Another day, another success. So today's goal was not overly ambitious, but it still pushed me out of my comfort zone and caused me to try something new. Today's goal was to complete two business to business outbound cold call role plays. Now I had a specific intention for those of you who know about business to business, when you do cold outreach to them, there's often something called a gatekeeper, which is a secretary, a front desk, a personal assistant. And this person serves the function of screening the calls of the decision maker. So in business business, there's these two roles, the gatekeeper and the decision maker. And the role plays that I did today were in regards to the gatekeeper, which in my opinion is the most important one. Because if you don't get it right with the gatekeeper, you're not going to get put through to the decision maker. So after a day of role play, which I did several, uh, the result was that my smooth intro that I crafted a couple days ago is now being put to use and getting good results. So the role plays that I did today, the results were quite good. I was quite satisfied with it and I got good feedback from them as well. They were both related to the gatekeeper. So I would say that for all intents and purposes, I'm pretty much solid on understanding how to how to speak to the gatekeeper, how to make them feel good, how to get put through, how to understand that process. I have a much clearer understanding of it today compared to yesterday. The thing that I need to work on next is how to talk to the decision maker. So once I can accomplish this, then I feel like when I go back to do more cold call, more cold calls, I'm gonna be completely covered. I'm gonna have my bases covered. So the gatekeeper plus the decision maker, both bases are covered. So tomorrow I'm gonna do two decision maker role plays. Today I got some great resources from one of my colleagues about uh, some role plays that he did. He, he gave me a role play recording. He also gave me a li two live call recordings, which is really excellent. So I'm going to go over those, see what else I can glean from his style. Uh, he's extremely successful at this, so I'm really looking forward to these recordings. Gonna go over the recordings, gonna understand how to talk to decision makers, going to work on my script for that as well and put it to use. So tomorrow I'm going to do two decision maker role plays. And something else is that it's been a couple days since the year started and I set my goals. I'm not, I'm really not clear about how I'm going to become a B2B leader. I'm not clear about the how I know it's going to happen. I know that I'm going to get promoted. I know that I'm going to wedge myself in as a successful B2B closer. But I'm thinking about how do I stand out as a leader? How do I how do I project that I have the qualities of a leader and the ability to lead in this multi multi million dollar company? Right? If it's a eight figure company, how do I act as an eight figure leader? That's what I really need to get to the bottom of. The, the, we had a meeting today with a very interesting perspective being shared. And that is that we are scaling our company right now. And right now we're at the uh, eight figure mark. But how do we get to nine figures? Well, you get to nine figures by having a nine figure mentality, not an eight figure mentality, a nine figure mentality. So right now I have a entry level mentality. How do I employ and implement a nine figure B2B leader mentality? That is the big question on my mind. That's the big question I need to answer. I want to become a leader. I need to position myself in such a way that they see extreme value from me. And it's good that I'm making progress. It's good that day by day I improve my skills as a B2B closer and it can only go up from here. So uh, thanks for watching again. Tomorrow you're gonna see that I am feeling much more comfortable in my B2B, uh, my B2B cold calls. 
and I will let you know how tomorrow goes. So until next time, this is Bo with the Hamming Chronicles. I will see you tomorrow, my friends.